Hey, what's going on guys? Today we're going to be taking a look at the HGUC Gundam Ground Type Parachute Pack. So this is obviously a P-Bandai kit, as you can tell by the monochrome box art here, with it featuring just a photograph of the painted kit rather than like a painted artwork that we normally see on normal boxes. So this is just the same HGUC Ground Gundam that came out not too long ago. And now it's got the added parachute pack on the back of it and some other uh, new accessories in there as well. So this is basically like the ground gun, the HGC ground Gundam with everything that you could possibly want it to come with in this box. So that's why I think this is a pretty cool kit and I'm really excited to check it out. So as always, huge thank you to USA Gundam Store for sponsoring this review. And guys, do check out the link to their site down below. They have P Bandai stuff and all sorts of other great stuff there. And you can get 10% off with my coupon code there, Zacharelius10. So check that out. Uh, around the box here, it's just going to be normal P Bandai styling, nothing really too much there, just the same kind of stuff. The list price on this one is 2,000 yen, so not too bad. Just a little bit more than the list price of the original kit. So we've got there, obviously, one of the new runners here, which I'm not exactly sure how many new runners we're going to have in here. It might not be more, might not be too much more than maybe just two new runners, I'm going to say, something like that, possibly. But you can see some parts on there, the parts for the parachute pack, and also including parts for the gym head. That's one of the new parts about this as well. That includes if you wanted to make the Gundam ground type with the gym head, as seen in the 8th MS Team series. So there's obviously the parts for the big box backpack. A couple of stickers in here, no water slides unfortunately. Just got some number marking stickers. I think those are the same ones that come with the just regular ground type Gundam. And then the manual, uh, interestingly, is a, just a whole new manual rather than just being like the manual from the ground Gundam plus a new page to show how to build the new parts. Interestingly, it's a whole new manual. So nothing really too much to show in terms of photographs. We can take a look at the parts list here. Yeah, so it looks like we've got two new runners added to the kit, runners E and D. Runner E is, looks like it's completely new. That's the one with parachute parts, parachute pack parts. Uh, runner D, though, looks like it's uh, from the ground gym, so at least most of that. I don't know if there's any new parts added to that. I'll have to uh, take a look. I don't remember offhand. Uh, but that includes, well, here we are. Just We'll just fold right to the back here. Uh, the net gun there, as well as the uh, missile launcher. We do have a color guide here as well. It's all in English. We don't have any actual color, as this is just all in black and white. But uh, everything's listed there in Japanese and English. Construction is just going to be all the same. There is the construction of the backpack there, which does look pretty cool. It's a shame we don't have a better picture of that to show you at the moment, other than just what we can see on the front of the box, which was not very clear. Well, let's get a look at the runners. All right, so first up here is our foil stickers for the kit. This is a new foil sticker sheet specifically for this kit. As you can see, it does say parachute pack on there. So I'm guessing it's just the addition of maybe these two big black stickers on there. Uh, maybe a, one or two extra cameras added for some of the new weapons. But then the marking stickers are not new, it's just the same ones that came with the ground gun. It's just marking numbers, and that's all in the big size and small size there. PC002 for our gray polycaps, and SB13 for our 144 scale clear pink beam saber effect parts. Runner A1 is big four color runner here. We got some red over on the side, a couple of yellow parts at the top, a couple of dark navy parts there at the bottom, and this really dark gray parts here for just some parts for the backpack, weapons parts, and things like that. And then a few more parts here on runner A2 as well, again, like parts for the backpack and the torso. Runner B1 is going to have the majority of our kind of off-white armor parts, so everywhere around in the kit, arms, legs, head, body, all of that. And then we've got runner B2 as well, which is a copy of this section of the runner over here. Then we've got runner C, you know, this is from the original HGUC ground gun, which came out in 2007, so this would be a much older one. Uh, which they just reused for the newer release. Then we've got runner C1, which is a bunch of gray parts here for joints and hands and a few weapons parts on there as well. Then we've got runner C2, which is a copy of this section of the runner here. Then we got runner D, which is just this one clear green part here for the eyes. And then runners D1, D2, and D3 are all connected here because they're separated with the different parts for the different weapons. So runner D1 is here and it's actually marked for rocket bazooka. And then runner D2 is there, which is marked for net gun. And then runner D3, which is new for this kit, is marked missile launcher. So that will be some of the new parts for this kit. And then also completely new for this kit here is runner E. Now this runner is marked for the parachute pack as that's what the majority of these parts are. But again, we also have the inclusion of these parts over here uh, in that uh, very typical gym color from the 8th MS team. It's kind of a soft cream color. 
for this parts for a simple new gym head there. So that's really cool. And finally, last but not least, Runner F is also something completely new for this kit, and it's just the clear green visor piece for the gym head. So there you go. As I said, this is basically everything you could possibly want in a HGC ground Gundam kit. And I thought I, I didn't, maybe was not very clear about this before, so I just wanted to show you this again. Uh, exactly what all weapons do come with this kit. So you have the machine gun, the beam rifle, the uh, long, I think it's 180 millimeter cannon, uh, the missile launcher, which is new, the net gun, and the rocket bazooka, and of course the shield and the beam sabers. So all of that stuff, plus the new backpack, plus the old backpack, plus the gym head makes for a pretty awesome set. So as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. Leave any of their further questions and comments down below. I'm going to get this built up, and then we'll take a look at it in the review. I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye. Hey, thanks for watching, guys. Remember, if you want to check the kit out for yourself, you can head over to USA Gundam store. Use that coupon code, Zakurilius10. Save yourself 10%. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. Bye-bye.